something but i have to work at three it's almost 1 30 i gotta go deposit this check and get gas because tomorrow morning i'm leaving early as possible to go to my friend's engagement party so i'm super excited about that excited to see them but i'm pretty stressed out because i have so much more homework and i worked 60 hours this week so i haven't been able to do all of my homework that I needed to and been working on it this morning working on my driving class online um, so life is great you gotta finish that driving class finish my homework before Sunday um, gonna get my schedule from work today to see if I'll be able to drive home Monday morning or if I'll have to drive home Sunday night Fingers crossed I can drive home Monday morning and just go to work at 2. That's usually when I'm scheduled if I'm going to close. So I'm praying that I close. But we're going to go get Jesse's package after we get gas. Got to get something to eat for lunch and then maybe get something for dinner. Uh, I don't know if I'm going <laughs> to order. I don't know. Whatever. Um, Might just go to our local sub shop and not subway but a sub shop it's more expensive but it's better so here we go uh on the road again so this literally always happens to me but every time i go to check the mail the mail hasn't run yet um <laughs> and then i pass the mailman five miles down the road as he's on the way to our mountain so uh i don't want to drive back hair looks like crap but it's still wet it's fine um i'm not going back but i just wanted to let you know that jesse huddleston decided to buy a pair of fish slippers i'm not talking like slippers i'm talking like sandals i don't know what this car is doing in front of me but i hate tourists <laughs> um they just stopped in the middle of the road for some reason all right but yeah, Jesse decided to buy. I always drop my phone. Uh, he decided to buy trout fish uh, flip flops or something. I don't know. Um, but they're probably going to be delivered right now. Oh my gosh! Tractor, tractor. Didn't know we were back in Pike County, y'all. Um, road work with a tractor. Good thing I left early. Like, I'm super glad. Not like I don't have five things I need to do before I go to work. And not like the parking lots are probably going to be full when I get there. And I'll have to park in a parking garage and walk 
five blocks or so to work, which takes me 20 minutes, and I'll be late. But it's fine. Everything's fine. Right? Yeah. So I'm sitting here. Um, wanted to get an update. Give an update on the fact that I went and cashed, not cash, I deposited my check. Forgot to get gas because I was rushing to try to get a spot in my parking lot designated to employees. And it was full. Again. So I had to go down. 12 miles to the parking garage. Um, I have to park at the top of the parking garage because it's also full. And um, I just ate half of my sandwich that I bought for lunch. And this family parks beside me and starts throwing a football in the middle of the parking deck. And it hits my car. <laughs> and they are looking at me and I'm looking at them with my sandwich like you did not go hit my car with your football why are you throwing a football in the parking deck what like I'm so confused but it's gonna be a good day um I have 20 minutes until I have to clock in um it's probably gonna take me the full 20 minutes to drive I mean I'm so tired. To walk from this location because I have to walk down four flights of stairs <laughs> because I'm at the top of the parking deck and I don't know why my life is so hard sometimes. Also, I dropped my key card somewhere. Like, I dropped my key card. I don't know where the heck it went. Key card! I don't know what that was that I just touched. Literally, I put it in my visor. And then I opened my visor and it fell down in the floorboard and now I can't find it so I'm going to have to get out of my car and just scavenge for my key card. Also pulled a muscle in my back yesterday. We got in 55 boxes of t-shirts and I have to take them all from the shipping room upstairs which is two flights of stairs. 55 boxes of, of t-shirts. Um, these boxes are half the size of me. I have to carry them two at a time up the stairs. My legs are so beyond sore, but my back, I literally, I pulled something in my back, like it hurts to breathe, but everything's fine. Um, so we're going to go to work. I get up at 11.30 tonight. We're going to go home. We're going to pack a small bag, and we're going to get up super early in the morning to drive to Georgia. I'm really just excited because I, I want to stop at Dunkin Donuts somewhere, but I don't know where one is unless I go through Knoxville home, which I might do. You never know. All right, wish me luck at work today. Um, at least I have dinner. <laughs> okay, so, bye. Let's see. Look at that fish right there, boss. Yee yee, brother. <laughs> Go. <laughs> oh, boy. Hell yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> what? Look at that fish right there. Look at that fish hook. How creative. Are you going to wear those around the house or something? I don't... Where are you going to wear these? Everywhere. On the boat tomorrow? Boat? I ain't getting in the boat. Good morning, everybody. I look like a wet rat, but... It is 8 a.m. and we're going to Georgia. All right, let's go because I got places to be and people to see and coffee to get. Update, just stopped to get gas and 
friends a coffee and use the bathroom at the Love gas station. And now we're back on the road again. Gang's back together! Back together! Jonathan and I are on our way to the engagement party. I'm looking like a wet rat. <laughs> I'm gonna continue to look like a wet rat once we get in the pool. But it's okay because it's 100 degrees in Georgia. And we're making a small pit stop for some, we out here. some ice and other things. And for some ice and some other things. And then we're going. Hard or going home. Huh? Tay! I'm spinning. Let me see the llama. Oh shit, I just broke the llama's leg. <laughs> More again. Hang on, let me smooth it back out. There we go. Bye! Are you leaving? Two Morgan two? Yes. Two Morgan. <laughs> and one more time. No. Kitty? Out. All right, Brittany, thanks very much. Before we go, let's get uh, little <laughs> predictions here. Okay, Final score. I got it. Thinking? Well, Georgia will hunker down. They'll win 37 17. 44 14, Georgia. Okay. I'm here <laughs> with Grandma. <laughs> it's Sunday, and she's trying Starbucks ice. Uh, pumpkin spice latte for the first time. Good. What would you say? Uh, out of ten. Nine. A nine out of ten. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, that means it's good then. She got decaf. I got calf. And now we're going home for lunch. <laughs> Maybe. We'll see. Bye. Bye. Don't don't pee in your new costume. Yeah, Grandma wouldn't let me get one for Maddie. Wow, Maddie would love it. Are you a ween? A ween? So it's Monday morning. I'm getting ready for work right now, but I just wanted to show my new bed setup that I got yesterday, new comforter, new pillows, new everything. First step of redoing our bedroom since we're doing one room at a time, but here it is. The coolest comforter, I literally felt like we were in a cloud, don't mind the mess, over there. We're still working on it, but this blanket is so soft. The only thing is the yellow blanket is leaving like fuzzies which is why I have a lint roller over there because it's like leaving fuzzies on the bed but I got everything at Ross um this white comforter is a down alternative but it was so comfortable like so cozy be great for the winter I'm so excited and these pillows are these uh gray pillows are so soft <laughs> and then uh, we actually just threw them at the end of the bed last night and then it was great the uh pillows everything and i got new pillowcases too so there's that and really quick i had to show the new towels new fall oven mitts they're so cute had to put them out for fall and then I also got this new pumpkin soap also at Ross so I have one for the bathroom and I have one for the kitchen too oatmeal in a Tupperware actually spilt it everywhere one minute going to make my iced coffee Careful. 